All right, coming up next for Gonzaga, we are going to have the men's third varsity eight race. And we've got two boats in this race, our junior boat and our lightweight boat. Uh, rowing in the uh, junior boat, we have Matthew Richardson stroking that. Patrick Gunther is in the seventh seat. Zach Cleves is in the six. Pablo Fox is in the five. Nathan Piat is in the four. Liam Downey is in the three. Martin Roman Perez is in the two. And Andreano Bays is in the bow. It is Cox by Sir Henry Ryan. And in the lightweight eight, we're looking at John Williams stroking that. Evan Hood's in the seventh seat. Chris Chan is in the six. Cal Donnelly is in the five seat. Luke Sandman is in the four. Will Thompson is in the three seat. Seamus Carroll Gavula is in the two. And Aiden Matthews is in the bow. Uh, it's Cox by Marshall Dylan Arrigan. And they will be in the middle of this course. Uh, it'll be St. Albans in lane one closest to us, then Gonzaga's junior boat, then Gonzaga's lightweight, and then Whitman in the far lane, lane four. Uh, and we'll be looking for them very soon, very shortly here. They've already gone up. And you can see the uh, third varsity eights lined up there. That is St. Albans on the far right, and then our junior eight center right, our uh, lightweight eight in the center left, and Whitman over on the far left, We're getting off here in a few minutes. And the junior varsity eights are on the water, I'm sorry, not the, yes, well, the three V's, including our junior varsity eight. And our JV eight looks like it got off to a good start there, as did our lightweight, right there in the middle, both of them. St. Albans did too. Everybody's moving pretty well early on through the gloom that has fallen on the uh, upper race course. And you can see Whitman going behind the pillar now, and then our lightweight will go there next. Lightweight went behind. Now our juniors are going behind. And I'll leave St. Albans there and pick them up here. There's Whitman coming out already. And up to about a third of the way done here. We'll see, get a better idea of who's in front. And those two boats look like they're right together. That's our lightweight and Whitman on the left. Our lightweight might be ahead of Whitman slightly. Our junior is right there with our lightweight. And the real question is where is St. Albans? St. Albans is coming out right there, right now. But the four boats are lined up. Still anybody's race as we get up to the halfway point. Yeah, they're all connected. It's quite a barn burner. We advance into the second half of the race. Still no clear leader. Coming up to the last third, and it's still anybody's race. When you get to those buoys, they'll be in the final 500. Looks like our lightweight is ahead of Whitman. It's all good boats look good. St. Albans kind of slowed down a little bit. Uh, I think it's got, got themselves back together and is coming back at the pack. Junior boat is now making a move. <laughs> you can 
It's a really tight race. It looks like our junior boat may be in the lead now. The lightweight and Whitman pretty much tied. And now we're coming on strong. Very nice looking race here. Look at that. It's practically of Olympic proportions with the boat so close together. It looks like our junior boat has it. They just finish. Our lightweight is going to take second at this rate. They just need to hang on. And look at that finish. Look at that beautiful finish. There goes the junior eight. There goes the lightweight for the silver. Woo! Excellent. Let's see the other two boats finishing there. They got to be really happy with that one. <laughs> nice job, boys. Nice job. It's the third victory for Gonzaga today.